box here. Tonight, I'm a choochin' on my old Peterson Shannon. And I got me just a little bit of cult abacus. And it's pretty good. It's not anything like Blood Red Moon. But it's a whole different can of worms. And it's pretty good. Listen, I was talking to a buddy the other day. A songwriter. That was expressing uh, concern about writer's block and talking about where ideas come from. And I thought I'd play a song for you first. Well, eventually, but I just wanted to let y'all know, give you a little idea about where old Pop got some of his ideas. This song that I'm going to play for you is called El Dorado, and it's, uh, it's about dealing with growing old, and like I said in my last video, you can Plainly look at me and see I'm growing old. But it's about dealing with growing old. But it was inspired by a four verse poem written by Edgar Allan Poe, one of my favorite writers. Um, a poem of the same name, El Dorado. And if you've never read it, you need to look it up. You can find it on the internet. It's only four verses long. Look it up. Read it. It's a very quick read. It's a very good read. It deals with growing old and coming to terms with growing old. But it's also inspired by a movie of the same name with John Wayne and James Conn and Robert Mitchum simply because it was one of my favorite movies. And how uh, an old drunk sheriff dealt with his age and growing old. And I thought I'd give you a little bit of background on another idea of, that I came up with, another song. Oh, Jilly Darling used to work for Domino's Pizza, and she'd bring home pizza every night, or several nights a week. And they used to run an ad campaign. And they had an ad campaign at one time where they'd say, nobody knows like Domino's. And then the rest of the campaign said, how you like pizza at home. But the main part of the campaign was, nobody knows like Domino's. And it was written on their box, nobody knows like Domino's. And one night, we were sitting there eating a pizza. And I read that off the top of the box. And I thought to myself, nobody knows like Domino's. <laughs> nobody knows like me. And all of a sudden it sparked in my head and I sat down and I wrote a song called Nobody Knows Like Me. 
And I sent that song off to George Jones's um, production company, to his publishing company. And they put a hold on that. And they paid me for nine months. And they kept paying me every month. They'd send me a residual check. Now, of course, Mr. Jones died, and they never recorded it. But I've, I've still got the copyright on it, and I've still got the song, and it never got recorded. But I drew a check, a residual check, for nine months just to hold that song. And um, anyway, I'm going to play you this song. It's called El Dorado. But the... I thought it was kind of unusual that the uh, um, that the idea of a song came from the top of a pizza box. It can be that simple. It can be that simple. But this song's called El Dorado. <laughs> are large he'll go back home to make her his wife so ride boldly ride through the mountains and valleys you'll make your El Dorado for long and don't go astray and don't fall shadows hold to your horse lest you fall there'll soon come a day when the road's called up yonder and everything gets swept aside so take to the mountain and take to the Valley and ride boldly, ride boldly, ride. Ride boldly, ride boldly, Saddle. But his wife and his babies don't lack He's made quite a way in the city, they say Selling dry goods and hardware and tack He wonders how tech went crazy but he still loves a night Austin breeze he could look for gold in Montana he's told but he's too old for his nuggets to freeze so ride boldly ride Mountains and 
valleys you'll make your Eldorado for long. Don't go astray, don't fall for shadow. Hold to your horse lest you fall. up yonder and everything gets swept aside so take to the mountains and take to the valley and ride boldly ride boldly Thank y'all. I'm old pops.